Hey everyone, my name is Gamer Corey, and welcome back to another Red Dead Redemption 2 Online video. And in this video, we are going to be doing some money making opportunities by doing a little bit of treasure hunting here in Red Dead Redemption Online. So, anyway, the one that we're going to be specifically looking at, if we can pull up our satchel here real quick, anyway, is we're going to be doing the Southern Roanoke map here. And I've already got it marked on the map, and it's actually not that far away from me, which is just north of Saint Denis. Now, there are a couple players in the area that I'm going to have to be watching out for just in case they try to kill me for whatever reason. But that could be something for another time. But anyway, what we're going to do is we're going to make our way north to Roanoke. And we're going to see if we can find this treasure right here, which is really close to Van Horn Trading Post. And just south of this uh, Butcher's Creek. So let's go ahead and make our way up there. And let's see how much money we can make from this treasure map. Now, there are a couple different gang hideouts along the way, and I missed out on an opportunity. Oh my gosh, look at all these birds, you guys. Oh my god. I really want these birds, and I really want them now. So let's go ahead and give these guys a little bit of a love tap. And, um, I mean, they're just, they're extra money. And I, you know what? I am all about getting some extra cash. That was a, that was a long shot. How did I even hit that? Anyway, we're going to pick up these birds because, you know what? <laughs> it's extra cash, and I I love me some extra cash here in Red Dead Online. And when I can get my hands on some spoon bills, I'm definitely going to take the opportunity to make sure that I keep them. So we're going to go ahead and mount one of these bad boys, or a couple of these bad boys on our on our horse. It looks like it might rain a little bit to the north. We should be, uh, we should pull, we should, uh, you know, pull out our weather forecaster and see if it's going to rain or not in that area. Well, the horse is taking a shit, so that means it must be going to rain. So I'm going to go in and skin this guy as well. And I know that I did not maintain a three-star pelt on that last one. But my god, there was a lot of birds. And I am not going to miss out on this opportunity. Because you know what? I told you at the very beginning of this video we were going to make some extra cash. I just didn't say exactly what way we were going to make money first at. But we are going to make some money here in just a little bit by going up and doing that treasure map. Wow. Anyway, let's go ahead and put this thing here, the spoon bill on our horse. And let's get this last um, spoon bill right here. I was going to say, if that was seriously a... Wait, what is this one? What is that? What the heck is this? That's not even showing up on my map. Can I pick this up? Oh, we're going to pluck the raven, too. May as well. I don't know what, how I don't know how it died, but... Uh, sure, why not? Anyway, we're going to go back to the train tracks because we're just going to go completely north on those train tracks. I was not expecting birds to be, like, right there. I mean, there are. There, there are opportunity for lots of birds in this area. And I know that they spawn right there, but I didn't was not expecting that big of a group of them. It was insane how many there were. And then it looks like we got another one right there. Whooping crane. Whooping crane. Um, do I dare? Nah, I'll just leave that one alone. But it would have been extra cash for us if we would have decided to do that. I'm going to go this train track right here. And, yeah, I've done, obviously, some videos on this specific area, so you guys will have to check those out. Uh, obviously, everybody knows about the bird Saint-Denis, north of Saint-Denis. But what we want is this specific treasure map. And I'm actually, I don't, I'm hoping for really close to a full golden bar or ingot. I would really like that. The last one, I think we only got, like, 0. 0.6, I think. And I think we got like 0.8, the one before that. So obviously we should be able to get over, you know, 50 gold bars here in just a little bit. And we are over $2,400 currently. And I am going to be saving up my money for a little bit of time because I need to upgrade some of my ability cards. All right, so we have entered this area. And my, my controller is actually already freaking out so let's go ahead and use our eagle eye here 
feels like I honestly it feels like it would be like right below me. I'm looking. Oh yeah. I see it. You guys see the gold right there? It is literally right below me. Um Hmm. We'll just jump off the bridge. Nice. Nice. Okay, if we can swim upstream a little bit. But yeah, wow, that was uh that was pretty easy. Let's go in and get in the first person. And that looks like, you know, we got the these things right there. We got some the fishing nets. I mean, it looks like maybe it might be like a crab bin, I think. I think that would be. Maybe maybe it's an old time fishing thing, but we're going to go ahead and open up this loot box fishing thing. I meant fishing like I don't even know the technical terms of them. But let's go ahead and collect our rewards. The last time that we had this happen to us, I wasn't able to actually see what we're going to get. We only got 0.5. Really? We're only 0.1 nuggets away from getting that, and we got $86 in cash. Seriously? I was really hoping that we we're going to be over 50 golden bars or ingots or whatever they're actually called. And uh, apparently just no. It's not going to work out too well for us. Maybe we should do a little bit of deer hunting and see if we can find ourselves. Horse, you're not going to pay attention to me, are you? I just want to see this thing like fall off the train tracks. It's, it's going to try to figure out where we're at. No, it's it's not. It's not stupid enough to do it, is it? No, it's not. It's it's a smart horse. Shadow Fox is an amazing horse. He's not stupid. Oh! I retract my previous statement. He is a dumb horse. He decided to run away from us. What in the world? Horse, I don't... You know what? I give up on you some days. I really, really do. Um, now, I know I've said this in some of my other videos. and But I would love to have more opportunities of things to do, you know, up here. There's just not a whole lot to do in this general area. I mean, there's no butcher. Anywhere really where near us, except for San Denis down here. We have one in Rhodes. But... We got one in, way over in Valentine, but there's nothing up in this entire area. It's so far to go anywhere to sell anything that you would even consider hunting up in this area or birds fishing, um, just other animals. It really doesn't matter. There really isn't a whole lot to ever do up in this area, and I never see anybody in these locations. So please, Rockstar, add some more opportunities for us. Now, there are some gang hideouts in the area, but we got to get ourselves a you know like a deer let's go ahead and plow through this river right here all right let's see what we can find here got uh, some horsemen oh we got a deer right there mm. I, i'm using a varmint rifle of all things because i was hunting the birds earlier but that works it doesn't really matter you know what kind of condition that we get our our carcass in it doesn't matter it doesn't matter. So anyway, what we're going to do is we're just going to kind of go around to a little bit of the different areas in this location. And we're going to kind of see if we can kind of get ourselves a gang hideout to appear. And I want to see if we can get a treasure map. Yep. Yep. Well, I happened to find a cougar chilling out on the train tracks. And, I mean, I've known about this cougar location for uh, for a long time. But I'm definitely going to take this carcass versus uh, that other one. I mean, the cougar is definitely worth more. Uh, I'll have to show this location in a different video. But it was kind of cool to just run across the cougar. And I wasn't even trying to. And, the only, like I said, the only problem about this specific area is there's no butcher anywhere near here. I mean, and I'm saying like anywhere near where I'm currently at. I'm trying not to give away the location too much. So I'm trying to look down at the ground, but I'm still looking for a fort and we're carrying our spoon bills way from down in San Denis. And uh, once we find a gang hideout, then uh, I'll be right back with you guys. Well, you guys, I think I had pretty much the most unsuccessful luck in all of a Red Dead Redemption because I went to like four different locations with a carcass on the back of my horse, first with a deer, then with a cougar, and I had absolutely no luck 
finding a single hideout. Now, what are the chances of that actually happening? Well, obviously for me, it would be a flat out 0% chance of ever happening because I got, honestly, the most unlucky possibility on the face of the earth. But I'm going to raid this camp. Now, if you guys don't know exactly, well, if you don't know exactly where I'm at, I am pretty much way north of anything. I am in Amberino. I started this whole video way down in San Denis, and yeah. That's all I'm going to say is just yeah. <laughs> so that's a location, or supposed to be a location, of a gang hideout. And I went to so many other ones, it didn't happen this time. Pretty much very unlucky in this specific video. But anyway, I did have fun trying to find a gang hideout and showing you guys, you know, a treasure map location. Hopefully you guys can find treasure maps all around the world and find a lots of treasures so you guys can get extra cash almost at 2500 bones what are the oh man i love that i love that saving up some money trying to update some of my ability cards what are you guys saving your money for let me know down in the comment section but that is all the time that i have for in today's video if you guys did enjoy or found it fun or entertaining or valuable in any way don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. It would help me out a lot and is greatly appreciated. But until next time, YouTube, you guys keep doing what you're doing because you're already doing it. And you guys, stay gaming.